you know, it's me or boy something. So, shout out to all my beloved choosing. So, I have this brief message to give you. Stop what proscarlating. Stop saying you will do it tomorrow. L listen, listen. You are what you are caused to be successful. Listen, the Lord has caused you to be successful. I know, I know. You know what I'm saying about. You know how big your dream is. You know how great your greatness is. You know the type of thing you dream to become. So you telling yourself you will do it tomorrow instead of starting it now. It's just like you postponing your what your greatness, your sources. So you are automatically ordained to be successful. Let's forget about funny things. Let's forget about where we are. Let's forget about the situation. Listen, you are um, you are mandated. You are mandated to be unique, to be great in life. So the thing that is killing us, we choosing is because we are surrounded with wrong people around us. We are surrounded with negative people who yield evil energy into our system, making us to feel that we can't do it. Listen, you need to disconnect yourself from people who don't increase you. I'm not here to tell you that you should hate them. I'm not here to tell you that you should not mingle with them. But love them in a distance. Because when it becomes red, you own you. Yes, I say so. When it gets red, you will understand you own you. Some people did not come. So majority of people who come into your life did not come to support you. Majority of people who come into your life did not come to assist you. Listen, devil can use your best friend to destroy your future just because of the bad energy he has been addicted to. So be mindful of what you do, what you perceive. Be mindful of the word you hear. Be mindful of people you surround with because your future is not in their hand, but your future can be promoted and increased and furnished by them. Why? Because Tell me your friend, I will tell you where you will be and who you, you are going to become. It's not, it's not only tell me your friend, I will tell you who you are. It's a big question. Who do you keep around you? Who do you associate with? Who give you information? Who is that that, that tell you this is time to, to read? This is time to preach? This is time to walk around? This is time to flesh? Who is that? Are they increasing you? Look at your life today and ask yourself, the people I am with now, what have I gained since I, I started to mingle with them? Is there any change? If people you are mingling with now and you realize the same spot you are two years back, one year back is the same, you need to change location. I'm not saying you should hate them. I'm not saying you should delete the number, but love them in a distance because whoever that does not want your increase, want your decrease whoever that don't want to support you don't want you to grow it doesn't matter how big your dream is but who do you mingle with something dream was stimulated why because the companion he keep around him delilah destroyed him it's not that something is not anointed to be great he was anointed to be the greatest warrior in the land of israel but he decided to mingle with the wrong people. He decided to associate with Delilah. Who is that Delilah in your life? Listen, who is Delilah in your life as a choosing? Who, who, what type of group do you keep? Who is that Delilah that you keep in your life? You think it's okay when you know if nothing is okay. Who is that Delilah? Let me check time. Who is that Delilah in your life? Who do you keep as a friend? Listen, listen, listen. You need to hear all this. Delilah is only meant to destroy it. It's not meant to, to increase. Even Jezebel is more better than Delilah. Because Jezebel fight for her husband. Delilah did not fight for something. But he, he tried or missed to destroy something. And he did it. Who is Delilah? Stop procrastinating. Stop saying you will do it tomorrow when you know your greatness lies in your hand. When you know you are caused to be fruitful. You are blessed beyond, beyond explanation. My brothers and sisters, who is that Delilah in your life? Let Delilah go. Choosing ones. I said 
let Delilah go. This is the topic. Let Delilah in your life, whoever de that is called Delilah, it can be your parents, it can be your brother, your sisters, your nephew, let them go. And move on and stop saying you will do it. Don't let anyone tell you this is not the rightful time. Because then the self can't do it. That is the reason why they want you to be proscalinating, saying you will do it tomorrow. It's me, your boy, Kiss Samson. Listen, if you have not subscribed to this channel, kindly subscribe and remove that Delilah. Then you will see the windows of heaven pulling out blessing. Because if Delilah is with you, there's some blessing God will not allow to reach you. You get what I'm saying? Not that God cannot bless you, but who do you keep around matters the Lord. So, if you have not subscribed, kindly subscribe and share this with as many you can. Drop your comment and tell me how effective it is to you. Remember this.